Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Reverse Crawl. Let's just head on with chapter 14 and just try and figure out what we should probably do. So, which one seems more interesting? Hmm. I'm gonna be boring. Reverend King, I will be most grateful if you're able to lend your assistance in taking care of a small matter. Sure, what do you need? And there is no need to sound so formal, by the way. It concerns some of my men that have regrettably allowed themselves to be captured by the enemy. In our society, male dark elves have always considered to be rather inferior, and rightly so in my opinion. You know, some people will say that's a uh, kind of sexist. In any case, it falls upon me now to liberate my followers from the predicament. Will you help? Free some dark elf warriors? Hey, why not? Let's go. Alright, so it looks like we got two range heroes, and the question is now which one shall I go? When this group is outnumbered? Oh, that's not going cursed. Violet Squad? Oh, that's a good versus armor dodge. We've got a whole bunch of bad, bad roles here, but. Look, my dark out warriors are being held in those cages. Right, how do we get them out? These heroes all have a key to the cage. Once we defeat any of them, the cages will open. Do be careful, however. While my men are in the cage, they can still be attacked by the enemy. Okay, well. Uh, okay, you got multi shot. Alright, alright. But, at least we can do this. And, oh, yep. <laughs> Oh well, alright, um, let's do power and let's do multi shot. Excellent, very nice power shot, and another multi shot. So far, so good. And we've got a wolf now, you know what? Let's, let's, let's aim at the mage, and um, what's this? They've got a potion. Well, that could. It's probably not, not very good, but nevertheless, I don't think we have much to worry about because. Well. I imagine they're all pretty dealable fairly easily. Oh, looks like. Well, we can move our Dark Award now. Very nice. So. Oh, oh, you're gonna miss. That's a shame. Moving on. Let's try and whack Stormbane a little more. We'll get the wolf to be attacking, attacking my chair a bit more, and then we'll just be pattering on damage a little. You know what? Multi shot isn't all that useful, actually. Well, right now, that is. But nevertheless, at least, um, at least, at least our wolf term came back as a skeleton warrior. So now we've only got Stormbane to deal with, and it's pretty easy, I dare say. So we only need to kill a trap now, which is not that hard. It's just a trap. What could it possibly do? Don't give up, more enemies. We'll just take a sip of my coffee, and now. This looks like a good chance to use power sh multi shot. Now that is quality damage. Let's combine this with a power strike. Yeah, look at that damage. Alright, moving on. Let's power strike more multi shots. <laughs> sure, why not? Alrighty, so let's. Uh, looks like he can only hit one guy, but yeah, well, let's just summon the skeleton warrior. Let's get a bit more tanky tanky. And uh, we'll just keep keep on plotting on, really. So this guy can, you know what? You will take the trash chest. Dark Elf Warrior covers some the HP and found singing chainmail of hell plus three percent dodge chance. I just it always feels like they're a little bit um like nonsensical or not as important, but yeah. Moving on, at least we at least we're able to deal with the military fairly easily, and he's multi shot worth it now. 40% of your normal damage to enemies now on 120, but this guy is guarding, which is really not all that useful. So we'll just go for a normal shot and hopefully deal with that guy pretty easily. You know what? Multi shot would be nice actually. He's still guarding, that's kind of a shame, but nevertheless, we can still just keep on shooting. Oh, you know what? You're gonna roar on stunners. How very, very daunting. Nevertheless, um, nevertheless, we can still keep on shooting, we can still keep on striking, and we should be able to dispatch Iron Hand and the Elite Militia fairly easily. Looks like our Skeleton Warrior lives to survive another day, and um, we'll just continue picking them off with arrows a little bit, because why not? Meh, there is more of them. 
And looks like our threat has recovered, so sure, why not summon another skeleton warrior? Your power strike. And uh, well, that did not go very well, but we can at least grab this chest. chest. Skeleton warrior currently in 9 HP and found plate mail of the wing plus 30 cream maximum. Oh, that's annoying. Well, actually, that's actually that's where our multi shot is actually quite useful. So, but you know, we can always just aim someone else. Well, well I'm an idiot. Never mind. I watched their power strike. Oh well. And um, well, you're stunned, so it means you can't use special abilities. Well, that's kind of a problem, but you know, I would love a multi shot right now. That's more like it. Right, so skeleton warrior. Let's summon another one, we'll do a power strike, we'll aim for ice wing. Oh no, she dodged. God damn it. Never mind, moving on. Fatal spell sword? Fatal sword? Hmm. You know It's getting to be a bit annoying. But four, we need to do a power strike with multi-arrow, and um yeah, that should clear out the mirror mirror image fairly easily. And um the good thing is about the multi-shot is that um, that with three, with three targets, uh, we get to do more damage, really, so, it's 120% of our damage. But yeah, um, it could be better, maybe, um, because it's, it's not like, it's like, I feel like maybe we should, we get more, better results if we try and focus one person down. And, uh, hopefully there's something we can do right now, so maybe kill Feral Sword. Yeah, that's more like it. It appears I have been critically injured. My apologies, Revenant King. Right, so zombies threatening or oh, flesh and bones tough. Uh we're gonna go with the zombies because mm, Pardon me, because of the resistance to magic magical attacks, but they're gonna take a while to get there, which is kind of a pain, but what can you do? And we just plot on and ooh, that is some very very good damage. Alright. Well, oh, that's a shame. How mean. And you know what? I'll just mock it. Summon Skeleton Warrior and I will power strike the Blood Lord down. And Skeleton Warrior, let's get you moving on. We'll keep moving forward. We'll get a power strike and kill that Ice Fang. Move the zombie up and hopefully get deal with that Blood Lord. Victory! Thank you! With your assistance, the Dark Elf Warriors will now rejoin our ranks against the Red Queen. Alrighty, so Dark Elf Angel. Aim straight to Dark Critical Hit Multiplier. Dark Elves will now counter attack when they're attacked by melee enemies. Hmm. Bonus to the chance of landing a critical hit. Um. I think, um well, I'm just thinking with the, the Power Strike would be quite nice. Um, but. Hmm. Yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> Alright. 8. All animals gain extra life generation recovers additional HP when guarding. Hmm, that's pretty nice. Hmm. All the world are ordinary. We get gain a small, uh, small amount of armor and life. Actually, that's pretty good. Yeah, we'll grab that. Alright, so we'll, we'll call that we'll call that quits. And um, now... Alright, so break the barricades. The mage defeat the Zalt Mage or defeat the sirens. Hmm. Let's go defeat the Zalt Mage. Okay, what are we doing in the Dusty Desert? This is a really hot and uncomfortable place to be. Well, no shit, son. <laughs> We're here to find someone, an exile mage. Hang on, didn't I exile a crazy old wizard here a few years ago? He wasn't really crazy, you just exiled him because you hated his beard. He was the one who taught me most of my magical skills. He will be a powerful ally if he can be pursued to rejoin us. Princess, you dare bring the idiotic king here? Prepare to die. Maybe this was a bad idea? <laughs> well, having the zombies would be nice, so, um, and this is a, got a healer and high health. So I want, um... Hmm... Range Archer appears to accurate attacks on high initiative. 
him some more help or I can go with the Reverend King. Uh, this is range, so King doesn't do much more damage, so let's just fight range with range, maybe. Um, actually, no, let's go with the Flesh and Bones. Zombies have 50% to magic attacks, guys. So yeah. You should concentrate on taking out those acolytes first. They have the ability to heal their allies, of course. Now, uh, uh the acolytes, goddammit, I'm an idiot. Well, never mind. Um, I'm, I'm sure we can get rid of them pretty easily, so... Um, so, let's uh, march, uh, let's focus, focus fire on acolyte. And, uh, oh, it looks like we're gonna be losing pretty quickly. It's kind of embarrassing. Let's hope the wolf dies first. Slash quickly, and uh, but nevertheless, that mage looks pretty darn tanky, I, I dare say. So, um, but already looks like we're down a few, we're down a few, um, minions. So, but those acolytes are really good at healing, which is actually kind of annoying. So, um, let's just hope we can actually keep, uh, let's hope we can just keep pushing on. We just keep focus firing, really, because, um. Yeah, sure, we'll have a zombie up here, we'll power strike the exile mage, because, yeah, what the hey. Uh, now, zombie, what can you do? Not much, really, so, can you kill the homunculus? Excellent. Very nice, so, we should be able to kill the acolyte this turn. Oh, so close. Well, they're for sure this time around. Alright, so, wolf, well, let's, um, let's get you kill that homunculus, and, um, hmm. Alrighty, so zombie, let's 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 focus the, on the acolyte, and then we'll keep just keep moving things around. We should probably summon a skeleton warrior, and um while we're at it, and um I think our power strikes are back up, so we'll take definitely take advantage of that. Alright, so so far so good. Uh, let's see, skeleton warrior, come move up here. So I'll have you deal with the whole monkers, and um the zombie, please kill him. Thank you very much. Right there, Exile Mage, you're in a bit of a pickle now. Wahahaha. <laughs> oh, you're guarding. Oh, very nice. Very nice of you. <laughs> we'll just keep whacking away at you until your health is all down. Wahahaha. <laughs> How shameful that you get down by a bunch of scouts. Impressive. You actually managed to defeat me. <coughs> I don't know what that was supposed to be. Mr. Gravier, we are here to ask for your help. The kingdom has fallen to the Red Queen and all is lost. Very well. I will assist you on two conditions. One, that idiotic king must apologize for my exile. Sincerely. Uh, sorry for exiling you. You can come back now. Ho ho ho. Now, admit that I have a nice beard. You have a nice beard. It is so soft and luxurious. Oh, I knew that already. Okay, count me in. Let's kick some butt. Ah, that was easy. Alright, so, let's see. Let's see, we've actually got a bunch of interesting new abilities. Um, this test gonna be dodging it feels, um, 20% additional damage, but... That's a focus. You have to gain new minion grip gray beer, maximum power increased by one, so let's heal. Let's <laughs> go with the heal all and um yeah, we got time for it a bit more, so let's see, let's see. Your mage attacks may attack after minion. Um makers all offensive power still busy. Um, Necromancy or undead minions have a dirty trick. It's not really all that useful, but um just I'm just trying to think. Which one do I want to aim for next? Um, yeah, this is pretty good, so we'll save the points. Alright, so defeat the draw, collect 1000 gold. Um, let's see, let's see, defeat the draw, defeat the cult leader. We've done enough killing, let's do some collecting. I hope you're looking for a powerful creatures to join us, hmm, Reverend King? That's right, do you have something in mind? Somewhere within these mountains, the legendary red dragon, perhaps we can name it. Whoa, a red dragon, that's so awesome! You know, I, I feel like I should actually use a more charges for the Revenant King the way the, the, um, the right can be. Hmm, won't be easy. First, we need to draw out, and to do that, we need a lot of gold. 
Fortunately, my distance cousin, the Orc Raiders, might be of some help. Whenever you defeat an enemy in this location, you will gain a small amount of gold. If the enemy is defeated by an Orc Raider, you gain us twice as much gold, winning 1,000 gold. Go! This, this seems pretty interesting, actually. Um, so it looks like uh, Barbarian, Melee, Hero, Group vs. Group, Range, Hero, Range, and a Ranger. So, what do you probably want? Um, let's see, let's see. Um, if the Range units are high initiative, or is that first? Yeah, let's go with the troll. <clears throat> Remember, finish off the enemy with your operators for a nice gold bonus. Alright, so we've got an operator there. Oh. Alright, so the wolf. Ah, uh, yeah, power strike. We've got to get the trolls moving as well, so powers. Looks like they're gonna gonna be taking a while to beat down, so we'll, yeah, we'll move the operator here, and we're, we're gonna keep belting down on them. And uh, there's not much this troll can do for now, so so far so. Oh, well, that's a shame. <laughs> oh. Oh well. Uh, nevertheless, we can um, keep going on. Um, maybe I should have. I don't know why I should have done with the operator, but um, but yeah, that's actually kind of a shame that um, the operator actually got killed in one go. But what can you do? All right, so stun trap. Well, felt like that's really the problem, is it? <laughs> Alright, uh, moving on, moving on. Make trap. Alright. And gonna keep bash bashing off water staff here. Even though it's a range, even though it's called water staff, it's actually a ranger, which is kind of not all that, uh, how to say it. Oh, that's a very terrible power strike. So, let's move up and let's keep working on it as your main. And, uh,. We'll do a power strike and you know what, let's heal. Get rid of the poison as well. And uh, we'll move this other guy up here. We'll go for a power strike and smack him some more. No, thankfully trolls can regenerate HP, otherwise they'll be, you know, pretty screwed. Uh let's Alright, getting there. We're getting there eventually. Oh he's done this. It's not very good. But at least we get the stuff first, so which troll are we on? We're on the middle one, so let's hope for a power strike. No, that's a shame. This guy, I can't heal him? That's a shame. Oh, well, God. Can't be that bad. Alright, now, yes, we can heal him. Woohoo! Alright, power strike. There we go. Come on, take him down. Okay, so I'm gonna focus. This is annoying. What the, what's the, what's the treasure chest there? I actually didn't see, which is kind of embarrassing actually. Um, so, ooh, that's a bard. And then we've got, alright, so... Let's summon a skeleton warrior, we'll smack the bard because it's like, well, I can actually see the bard and, yeah. Okay, so, looks like that metal eater is the one that we need to hit, so... Let's remove this troll over there, give everyone a bit more space. And let's say we expect to smack. No? That's kind of annoying actually. Hmm. Well, moving on. Um, moving on, we should be able to. Oh, that's so annoying. Alright, you know what? Let's just kill the bot. Let's just. What well, my minions keep missing? That's kind of annoying actually. Well, we're getting there eventually, but it looks like looks like the damage being pounded on fairly quickly, so we've got no threat either, so that's actually gonna be a problem. So let's take a tip of my coffee while we continue clicking. Alright, so got flesh and bones. Got two majors. I like to heal all, all allies and um extra armor. Extra armor's not really that useful actually, um, but... So, I feel like the flesh and bones is actually better for this. So... Alright, so Skeleton Archer, so... I think the Skeleton Archer I could at least take care of the evolution, so... 
Actually, well, I know that I'm supposed to hit that one now, so... Uh, well, 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 we can Diamond Core up here, and then, um, we'll just keep moving, moving on, so... Move the Operator up, and then we'll move... Another Operator up. Oh, sure, why not? And then, okay, we'll move a Zombie up, and just take a smack at this one, because we know it's an illusion, and, uh... We'll move the other Zombie up as well. That's the problem with the melee, you kind of just have to move them up, but... Oh well, look! One turn? Not that bad, really. Um, so... We'll do that and, um, hopefully get our Orc Raiders onto the job. Okay, let's get a power strike. Woohoo! More gold! Alright, zombie. Um, uh, power strike. Don't... Better not kill her, actually. But, um, certainly we would love our Orc Raider to get up there, so, um... Hmm... Color strike, uh, skeleton archer, don't kill her yet. Alright, let's get the orc raider up there and give her a smack. More gold, woohoo! We can do this. Right, so this bow is just gonna be annoying. We should probably kill that trap as well, so... I'm gonna summon the skeleton warrior, kill that trap, and that should work, that should work out very well. No, no, it's actually quite nice, we can actually target the, the traps with our skeleton warriors. And, um... Alright, so, we will... We run out there. We just basically should keep spreading them out, I suppose. So, but then um, I suppose um, he's he's like Bali just tracking our skeleton after, so we should probably like deal with them as well. So we've got a zombie. We'll move that zombie out, and um, hopefully we should be able to deal with this fairly quickly. But unfortunately, our old creator has been dealt with. <laughs> Alright, oh, that's a shame. Well, let's get rid of this trap. And, um... Okay, so, we can power strike it as your maker. I think we've had that one already, so... Nevertheless, um, zombie. You can deal with metal vine. And, um, let's see, who goes first? Alright, let's... Let's get Bow Eater down a little more. Power strike. There we go, and then... Our operator can finish the job for us, so that should be fairly easy. <coughs> well done! We've collected enough gold for the big dragon. Let's get moving. New minion group operators. I feel like I'm getting too many minion groups now, which is actually kind of a problem, but oh well. Right, um, let's see. All creators will mostly end the suffering of the wound, do 50% more damage to less 25% health. Gain one di one additional trait if an orc raider finishes off an enemy. Why waste good food? All your minions will gain HP slightly and lose one negative status. Ooh. Um, enemies less than twenty five percent health for one additional threat. I think I'm gonna go with the one additional <laughs> threat because I think this that's pretty useful. So yeah, I think we made a lot of progress. Oh, we get to summon the red dragon. So I'll leave that for the next video. So with that. Thank you for watching, if you'd like to see more, feel free to subscribe, and of course, I will see you on the next video.